Hi, this is PC Roger. What I'm here to show you in this video is the replacement of a hard drive in this Dell Latitude D630 laptop. This uh, unit started to make kind of a clinking noise a couple of days ago, and uh, the thing to do when that happens is to immediately back up your data. Anything that's important to you, don't shut off the machine. Take a USB stick or USB drive, plug it in, connect it to a network, whatever you need to do, get your data, anything important, off of that machine. Because the following day, the machine booted up and we got an internal hard drive error. Would not read the drive at all. So we need to replace the drive and Dell will happily ship us a new drive, but depending upon what kind of warranty service you have, you may or may not get a technician provided to change that for you. So I want to show you how easy it is to actually change the drive. Here we have the unit and it's powered off. I'm just going to close the lid and you'll see on the bottom Try to get this by the camera here. This is the hard drive inserted in here. And you'll notice there are two screws that each have the little hard drive symbol next to them, or at least that's what's supposed to be a kind of a disc symbol. And those two screws need to be taken out and the hard drive will slip right out. I'm going to set this down upside down on a nice soft towel here. And we'll just take these two screws out. And what I like to do is take an old frosting container, put those screws in there, because I don't know where I'd get a, another one if I lost one. So put them in there, I'm gonna put the lid on it. And then with those two screws out, the drive will easily just slide right out. Once you have the hard drive, you can see that the, the drive is here and there's just, just this little uh, bracket to actually hold it in the, uh, and onto the drive, this, this uh, piece of the casing. And there is one screw in the side there that we need to take out. And I guess I shouldn't have put the lid on that uh, frosting container yet. Then we can just kind of wiggle this off. You can see there's a little uh, kind of a notch on the other side. We can set that down. And here we have the hard drive. And then all you need to do to change the drive is, is take the new drive, put that piece back on, slide it in, two screws, and it's ready to go. And depending upon the uh, situation with the drive, Dell may have sent you one with an image already installed so that all you have to do is turn it on and it's just like it was when it was brand new. But the important thing is it will not have your data on it and you will need to restore from a backup. I hope you have those backups. And if you need help, in learning how to back up your, drive, your uh, data on the hard drive, go over to my website and uh, the link is right there on the side of the video and you will get some help on how to do that. I hope this video has been helpful. Thanks for watching.